What's good, YouTube? You're now tuned in to the Infamous World Network, and it's your host, the Infamous Jerez. If you're new to this channel or if you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe. Also, make sure to like the video, feed the algorithm, it helps new viewers see my channel. And last but not least, make sure to ring the bell, finesse the bell so you can get a notification every time I upload to YouTube. Also, if you guys are into Instagram, you can catch me on Instagram at underscore infamous world network on my instagram you can see trailers to my videos you can also see thumbnails that i post there and also on my story i post everyday sneaker stuff too so if you're into that you can check me out on there now with that out the way gang let's do what we do best on this channel let's talk kicks all right all right so you know we just got this bad boy in the mail man i'm gonna open this up we're gonna see what we got here oh yeah boom we got a nice one in the mail today. This box is super nutty, man. Like this box looks like, looks and feels like it has tape on it. Like, and like <laughs> the way the Nike swoosh is, man. This Nike swoosh really got me cracking up, man. <laughs> Wait till you see the, f <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Top of his head. <laughs> this dude Virgil, he really be on some creative stuff that like doesn't even look creative. That dude got a crazy, crazy head on his shoulders. So this shoe came out uh, August 9th on the sneakers app. From August 9th up until like August 18th, I forget what day to be exactly sure. Sneakers was dropping exclusive access every single day. That's something new that they're gonna be doing for hype sneakers to give people like me that don't have a bot or a plug a better chance to get it. So that was pretty cool because I actually hit on the exclusive access. The shoe I got unfortunately was lot seven out of 50. That wasn't the lot I wanted. I wanted to be a spoiled kid and I wanted to get lot one or lot 50 maybe two or 49 there's one in the middle i like as well but fortunately for me seven out of 50 is not bad and the shoe already has a little bit of value me myself i'm not big into reselling shoes i'm really big on wearing your shoes so i'm gonna try my best not to sell this shoe at the next sneaker show i go to i'm more than likely gonna try and trade this shoe with some cash on top to get a grail or get some heat we'll see how that goes for the kid i got good faith but the shoe is a white mesh Shab I take that back. The shoe is a white canvas. Uh, it has white canvas hits on the toe box, the side panels, and the ankle. And then it has uh, gray leather all around. The gray leather is very soft and actually caught me by surprise. The gray leather is very nice. The white canvas hits as well on the toe box, the side panels, and the ankle are nice as well. The shoe has a Nike hit on the back. The overlaces for my pair are like a minty green. And it says shoelaces on it as well, which is the classic off-white Virgil branding. Um, my shoe comes with white laces that also have the classic shoe laces and quotation branding on the shoe as well. On the inside of the left and the right shoe, it also has the classic off-white branding. It comes in a really nice chrome gray on this pair. I really like how that looks. It's like a silver. Um, it shines really nice. It's super dope. On the outsides of the shoes as well, you have the lot hits and then the mines comes with like a blue hang tag and then also has a lot seven out of 50 hit on the outsole as well and it's really dope because it's like a paint splatter so i like that as well but yeah this shoe retailed for 180 which is a little nuts for a dunk most of them retail at 100 or 110 sorry if i'm incorrect on that but this shoe did come out for 180 dollars and that's nuts for a dunk but you know when off-white and nike come together the rules are thrown out the window and they can do whatever they want but the shoe coming out for 180 at least the shoe does have good quality so that is a saving grace and there is a lot of them that are nice so i would say the 180 dollar ticket is justified the shoe also comes with a different box the box seems like a kid made it i don't know why virgil does weird stuff like that but the, the box is pretty cool there's not every day you see a shoe box like that so the box is pretty cool and the shoes are pretty dope so i guess the shoes were 180. all of these shoes unfortunately have already doubled in resale tripled in resale so if you're looking to get the shoe and you didn't hit for retail you're gonna have to cough up some coins but that's the name of the game right now it's officially supposed to be called the summer collection um, but a lot of people are calling it the 50 and honestly i like calling it the 50 as well because the first 10 pairs of shoes that Virgil's did was the 10 and the 10 has a lot of classics but yeah so this is the dear summer collection or the 50 big ups to Virgil on this um, I would say another hit on him he's pumping a lot of life into the sneaker game 
I appreciate everything he does and other sneaker enthusiasts like me, they appreciate it as well. Unfortunately, everything he does comes with a lot of hype, but you know, that's part of the game. If you hit exclusive access on this shoe, super lit for you. For the people that didn't, it's a little unfortunate. You know, you're probably gonna have to pay an arm and a leg for a resale, uh, but the shoe's not bad. Um, it's not the one I wanted, but I am grateful. We are grateful boys out here. Anytime you hit for retail, that's a www.win. Um, and for the Infamous World Network, we take wins out here. We take wins. On my scale of 1 to 10, I'd give this shoe a 7 out of 10. This shoe is very decent. It's not fire fire, but it's not trash trash. I like this shoe a lot. Uh, we'll give it a 7 out of 10. If you hit on the exclusive access, make sure in the comment box to let me know what lot you hit on. Let me know if you like the lot I hit. Um, also, just make sure to show love. Like the video. Subscribe as well. And if you haven't already, check me out on Instagram. And with that being said, gang, we'll catch you on the next episode.